Hello students, in this video we are going to discuss the design tab of the Microsoft Office PowerPoint. So let us start with the various designs. Okay, you can use the designs which are available in your PowerPoint software. You can also select the designs in the online versions also. You can select the slide size. So let's start with the first with the slide custom slide size. By default, generally we can use the 4 is to 3 format ratio format generally we use this or the second one is the wide screen option or you can use the 16 9 ratio or you can use the 16 10 ratio also you can use whichever whichever which is useful to you so for example if you know the size of the screen which you will be using then you can use that specific slide also okay that slide also now you, there are two options which are available here so in this you will be scaling to a new slide size and it would like you to maximize the size of your content or scale it down to fit the new whichever you want to use it depends on which on the format which you are going to use use so whenever you start start with the powerpoint presentation you want to create a presentation the first thing you have to do is the design and select or select the design of your slide and for that first first part should be selection of your slide size right now i am going to start with the wide screen option which is available on my computer and I'm going to use the maximize option right now. Okay. And next option will be the formatting the background. I can change the background whichever I would like to use. Okay. So select this also by the here also. Okay. You can use any of the backgrounds or you can also create your on background by just selecting the image which you have downloaded for example i am selecting the image okay this will be my background okay so right now i'm going to use the gradient field which is the option available here okay that's all uh, for the slide size and the format background option so now Next option which will be the slide different options which are available which I want to use okay you can use any of the options wide screen okay next as I told you you need to select the slide systems slide phones which are available different type of slides so in design you can there are variety of options and you can create your own design or also you can also browse for things okay which you might have downloaded from the online versions okay you can use any of the themes or you can create your own theme also okay you can create your own theme also for example for example you can change the custom colors you can change the fonts whichever you would like to change okay so some of the fonts are used by default in the some of the slide editing options so next option how to design your slide okay let us start with that option so right now i have used this version uh, this design which is the wood type and I would like to further edit this wood design. Okay, I would like to edit for that. I'm going to use the function which is there in the view tab. In the view tab. In the view tab, I am going to click on the slide master. I'm going to click on slide master. 
and the in the slide master i will pull this and i'm going to select the first slide this will be my first slide and i'm going to start designing my slide from here itself okay whichever design you use okay so by using this it will save my editing time and confirm the uniformity in the case of design in the powerpoint presentation now let us add shapes for example for example i am going to use this square okay next i am going to select the color i am going to remove the border and further i am going to edit the points according to my design next for the edit points so you can design your own whichever you would like to use okay now you can see in the all slides okay except the header slides you will see this design okay as the fonts used here are already good i will not i am not going to change the fonts here but i want to use let's say uh, this bullet option star bullet option i would like my text to be justified i would like my text to have line spacing of 1.5 i would like to increase the font size you can do here itself you can do here itself for example in the second level i want to use this dark color okay you can select this by default okay and in the slide master further i am going to change the i i can challenge the different color options i can change the different theme options again or i am going to use the let's say effects option okay i can use whichever i would like to use you can also change the background similarly and s now if you have finished your designing the slide you can close the master view now you can see the options which are there now what happens for example i am going to add the content now see what happens so you can see color has changed automatically i have not changed the color by myself here okay this is how good if it is good if you use the slide master options so first before starting the presentation so please start with the designing of a slide for example in designing of the slide first you need to select the size of the slide then go to the slide master select a theme or create your own theme also or you if you want to use the used theme and if you want to edit you can do that way also and check the fonts design whichever you would like to add and just close the slide master and save your presentation okay and save your presentation so this step basically reduces your time of the editing okay that's the reason we need to first select the slide size and designs which are you are going to use that's all in this video thank you